Hey guys, so we had this uh, international come in, get towed in this afternoon. We got it in here and we have after treatment faults in the in the ECM. We got an active 1922. You can see the diagnostic in it. You can see it's at the most severe level. It's got 6.49 ounces of soot load, 33.6% ash load. All right, so we got new technology that we're gonna try on this unit. We haven't done it before. From what he's saying, I think it'll save customers quite a bit of money. It's a maintenance item for the regen system. This one came in in the most extreme situation where it had to be towed in, it was in full D-rate. David, can you explain a little bit what it is? What I'm gonna do is show Todd and you guys how our hydrogen machine, which is this green box, produces 3,400 liters of hydrogen per hour. We're going to feed it through the intake before the turbo and allow it to decarbon the cold side of the engine. Second phase of our process is we have a BAC chemical flush and a BAC chemical soap that we put into the diesel particulate filter to clean it. It will eliminate soot, ash, pick up your oil residue. Once the chemical's in, we do a forced regen on the truck. Once the regen's done, we should be able to get readings that show the ash and soot levels at or close to zero. All right, so we got done with the process. This thing regen for probably an hour, hour and a half. Wanted to show you the numbers on the computer. So this thing started out with a 6.5 soot load on it, most severe level of soot load. As we were going through it, we were monitoring everything and watched everything tick down. So you can see here under the soot load, it's at a zero. Now, I reset the computer, the max over here would pay, show 6.5, but I took a picture of it before we reset everything. So it went from a 6.5 to a zero. So just like all the haters out there that I'm sure that's gonna come on, I thought it was snake oil too, but David has proved it to me on the most severe one that we've had in a while in here. I mean, it was in complete D-rate, that's why it had to be towed in. And he ran his process through it. The, the proof's in the, the, the computer don't lie. It cleaned everything out. Everything's normal. There's no fault. Each level it went down as it was cleaning the, and going through the regen. I think this is a maintenance item that can really save you a lot of money. The labor alone, the tearing all that stuff off, the clamps break. Some of those clamps are over $100. With David's system, cleaned it without doing all that.